Hello and welcome back again to our channel and today's episode we'll be doing a diecast car unboxing and review and this time take a look at this beautiful a Honda Civic FD2 Mugen, Mugen RR Advanced Concept from Inno64 now Inno64 is kinda new to the uh, uh, 164 market uh, I think they are newer than the Tarmac Works brand I'm not really quite sure that they still don't have a lot of uh, cars compared to the older ones like Hot Wheels, Tamika Atomica have has the uh, limited vintage cars and they are almost at the same price range with this uh, Inno 64 here but I think the these Inno 64s look way better than the Tamika limited vintage Neos and I'm going to show you an example of their car here so all the cars the Inno 64 cars come with this acrylic case and with acrylic base that has some descriptions to it which is really cool now <coughs> their cars uh, don't roll though so they are meant to be displayed so they are not toys they are display pieces so cool thing here cool details on the back of the case so you can see the map oh wait is that a map or something it's not really printed quite well or is that some uh, graphical something about the uh, Honda Civic FD2 Mugen so in the middle says Mugen advanced concept and some details on the car here so let us open this one it's a beautiful acrylic display case comes with a screw so you can unscrew this one and remove the car but in today's video we will not be unscrewing this one because I lost my screwdriver somewhere and here is the Mugen on the Civic so <coughs> cool this cool uh, details here on the base it says Mugen's uh, Mugen at RR advanced concept the base is not has some texture to it <coughs> so similar texture to what the car has you can see I don't know if you can see that one Wait. yeah you can see the texture of the car it's like carbon fiber like texture which is really really cool really awesome no sponsorship decals on the car just plain street looking car love this one here check out the front of the car now all parts of the body have this uh, carbon fiber like finish or detail to it which is really awesome and yeah these cars here that Inno 64 are based <coughs> on the real real car on a real car so lovely lovely rims with a red uh, lip that six spokes right there you can see the caliper detail you can see the brake details really awesome and check out the interior you can see the details too on the interior racing seats that are detailed red and black even the rear seats have that red and black details check out the uh, rear window JDM JDM style right there, pretty awesome. 
details on the rear tail lights are plastic and a bunch of tiny details here you can see right there civic and then on the plate it says mugen rr of course the red honda logo for all their type r's dual exhaust up front again red honda logo for all their type r cars Ta uh, headlight is plastic Whew. a lot of good stuff and this car here pretty expensive though will cost you almost twenty dollars i bought this for 900 here but they they had the sale so 20 percent off so bought this for only 720 pesos that's around let me, see, let me guess uh wait 50 uh, oh se what, 700 pe 720 pesos that's around less than eight dollars right no less than 16 dollars <laughs> not really good in math so here it is again beautiful beautiful car spoiler is die cast metal again i won't remove this one from the base this car won't roll so just display case display to your diorama or whatever <coughs> and pretty awesome here i'm gonna take a picture for the thumbnail that's it an awesome car awesome review i hope you enjoyed this one and if you did don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet <clears throat> and if you guys uh, will be able to find this in store i rec i had i highly recommend you to buy this one if you like premier 164 scale cars hey, go ahead pick this one up you won't regret you won't regret it advantage on uh, this one being not able to roll is it won't fall it won't slide down when you put it on your uh, rotating display or on your uh, diorama set pretty awesome right look at that look at that oh i forgot i forgot to put this one here Yeah, so I think that will be all again. Bye-bye, guys. Happy Halloween again. And stay tuned for more. Bye-bye. See you soon. Peace out. Enjoy the rest of the day.